so here I am in that peacock colored sweater. And I have it paired with uh, my gray skirt um, with leggings and an old t-shirt. It looks almost a neck now. Oh, well. <laughs> anyway, an old comfy t-shirt that I got from Walmart a couple of years ago that's in that kind of teal, muted teal, and which I'm always trying to tell you, make sure you look in your closet for things that go with what you're looking to do. And, uh, or, you know, like if you're looking for the Pantone of the Year, start with what you already have and work from there. Um, my object is to get you to make wise choices for your wardrobe so that we're not contributing to the waste of textiles in, that do not, um, do not deteriorate well. Um, sometimes they harm the environment and so on. So we want to be more um, mindful of what we purchase. Now, for me, even, you know, because I have an, kind of a nice wardrobe, um, I have things, I buy kind of classic lines and stuff, and I keep them for, you know, years. Um, most of my clothes are 10 or 12 years old before I decide to donate them, and they're still in good condition. So um, that is kind of my rule of thumb. Okay, I've had it about 12, 15 years. I think it's time to let it go. Um, truly, that's what I do. And uh, it doesn't seem to matter where things come from. Um, your more expensive items wear better, but then you tend not to wear them as much. I I kind of like to keep comfortable price points so that I'm like not going, oh gosh, I paid so much for it, you know, like, which I kind of do with my J. Jill stuff. That um, doesn't go to my everyday stuff um, for a number of years. So, um, and then, you know, sometimes I buy things and like yesterday I found something in my closet that still had tags on it that I purchased because I didn't know when my mom would pass away. So I always wanted to make sure I had like outfits for every season. So I had like a nice spring dress in black that I could wear yesterday um, for a doctor's appointment. So, you know, but now it's probably because I've had it a few years, I probably will wear it more often. So it's kind of a nice thing too, you know, so. Anyway, and it's kind of nice sometimes that I buy a head because then if something special comes up, I have it. Um, you know, like last fall, I did buy a specific um, dress for my godson's wedding and nephew's wedding. Um, so, you know, because of something special like that, I did. And um, which turned out to be kind of black and white, but um, I kind of looked what his mom, who was my son's godmother, wore to my son's wedding and kind of played with the same color scheme. She did a black and white thing, so I did. So it was kind of to honor my sister-in-law's memory too that I picked that dress and it worked out really well, it looks nice. I have a really nice dress in my wardrobe um, that I can wear anytime for any occasion. So that is something too. So. Um, I hope you enjoy the rest of this color haul. Here you go. This is something I've been waiting for for this peacock haul. It's a little smaller though, I think, than I was expecting, but let's see what it's like. I hope it's going to be useful. I'm planning on putting this near my chair in my daughter's room and then I'll than in a guest room or my crystal room. Uh, at another time, but that's not as small as it, I thought it was going to be. Okay. And what it is, oh, and it's not plastic. Well, it might be, but it feels like leather. It's pleather and it has a peacock on it. It's a wastebasket. And it's washable, you know, it's a washable leather feeling, kind pleather type of material. 
But there are the peacocks. So, yeah. I think with like that it. peacock theme, I changed my bedspread uh, or comforter set to this really pretty peacock velour set from Target uh, a couple of months ago. And I'm really loving it. My husband thought thinks it's really pretty too. I still have the purple one, which is over here, part of that set. And I'm gonna swap them out every few months to keep things nice and fresh because this seems to be the cat's bed. <laughs> they, they think it's a cat bed. All the cats love to congregate on my bed. So there is that. And my daughter's dog likes to try to get up here once in a while. No doubt my Mazda, when she visits, might even be <laughs> sometimes taking a nap up here. So it needs to be swapped out every once in a while. But I'm loving this one. My husband thinks it's pretty Of course, I was attracted to this beautiful chrysoprase uh, generator from Sage Goddess. It has this really pretty crystalline area um, in in this that has that teal color inside too. So I even managed to get something from the gem family in the peacock hall here from Sage Goddess. So, and I love this energy. It's, I love chrysoprase. Anyway, so there's so that. I hope you're enjoying these peacock hauls. This was the third one. I, um, there's one more. Um, until next time, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. And by the way, I have something new. I'm on Patreon too. Anyway, you want, might want to check that out. So thanks for watching. See you soon.